It's, uh, wanted to do a quick video on something uh, that I think can get overlooked sometimes, and that is condiments on food. So like sauces and things that we do or that we put on our food. Uh, I am always looking for either zero calorie or very low calorie uh, sauces and we kind of live in a golden age of condiments right now where there's actually a lot of really really great condiments and sauces that we can cook with or that we can put on our food that are very low calorie or zero calorie so I'm just gonna give you some examples of ones that I use that are zero calorie uh, Frank's Red Hot original not the buffalo one that definitely has calories in it because they put butter in it but the original is zero calories Cholula is amazing, um, use that a lot. Tabasco is zero calories, so if you put Tabasco on your eggs or on your omelets, that's amazing and zero calories added. Mustard is generally zero calories most of the time, including uh, spicy mustard, honey Dijon mustard, of course, they're gonna put sugar in that, um, usually with some other things. Uh, sriracha is zero calorie, a lot of hot sauces because they're all vinegar based. Um, there's a great company called Walden Farms they do zero calorie barbecue sauce, zero calorie Asian inspired sauces and marinades. They do zero calorie uh, salad dressing and they have pretty much everything, including ranch. Of course, it doesn't taste the same as regular ranch, of course, but it's pretty close. And the difference between adding, you know, anywhere between three to 500 extra calories to your salad or to your food, whatever you happen to be putting ranch on. So it can make a huge difference. And if you find that you actually don't mind it, like what, I mean, look at how many calories you're saving over the long run. Um, and then, you know, for your treat meal, if you want regular ranch on pizza or, uh, you know, with fries or something, whatever, do it. Uh, I'm trying to think of some other uh, low or zero calorie condiments. Ketchup usually has a lot of sugar in it, so I would just recommend getting a brand that is lower calorie, either uh, marked as low calorie or uh, just doesn't have any extra added preservatives and sugar and things like that in it, if you can find it. Uh, I think Walden Farms actually has a ketchup that's zero calories. Uh, yeah, and oh, salsa. Salsa is another one that's very, very low calorie. Now, depending on what the brand is, I know some brands have more than others, but most brands, especially if it's like, if it's homemade, very, very low calorie. Uh, but you can find a lot of salsas that have very low amounts of calories, like, you know, quarter cup for 10 calories or something. And if you're mixing that in with your eggs or with your food, uh, that's a lot of flavor for not a lot of calories. So you're saving a ton, but you're adding a little bit of something. So I'll give you an example. This is, this is Bachelor Kyle before, uh, you know, I just really started cooking more and Pamela and I, when we started cooking more meals together, uh, one thing that I was eating, I was eating, I'd come home, and this is just because I was so tired, I was working at Cerner and I'd close the place down. And I'd get home, I'd have leftover ground beef or ground turkey, I'd put that in a bowl, I'd put rice in a bowl, it was usually microwavable Uncle Ben's rice, because I could make it really, really quickly. And then I would throw literally a can of vegetable medley in it, so I got some micros in there, okay? And I'd mix all that up, it'd be super hot, and then I'd put maybe like two big tablespoons of salsa and just mix it all up. And it, it tasted amazing always, you know, it was savory, but it had like that dichotomy of like the vegetables plus the meat and the rice and it all just kind of coagulated and blended together. Uh, and I, I ate that for like an entire year, every night for dinner, Monday through Friday. And it was very low calorie, really good macros because I could, I could load it up with protein and you got the micros from the vegetables. Obviously, it would have been more nutritious if I had like put actual vegetables in a skillet and then put that in the bowl. But I was lazy, didn't have time. So you got, you got to do what you got to do sometimes. But uh, yeah, those are some low calorie condiments or zero calorie. So if you're doing like wraps during the day, throw some mustard on there, some, uh, some spicy mustard. If you're doing... Uh, like an Asian inspired dish for dinner, or you've you got some fish, get some Walden Farms marinades and sauces that you can throw on it. If you like hot sauce, like load it up, get, get as many varieties as you can that are zero calories and play around with it. Maybe there's certain proteins that you prefer Cholula on versus Frank's Red Hot or Sriracha. Uh, I like Sriracha on pasta dishes, so we do that quite a bit when we, when we make protein pasta, uh, really good stuff. So yeah, that's my video for today. Condiments. All right.